Hello fellow TVs, this is Kazim Ferret here and welcome to Shovel with our new master dating sim. Begin my journey. You may first say approach your school's campus. You know that day and that today is the day that the new transfer student arrives. His name is Hollywood Superstar Shadow LaBeouf. You've seen his pictures in all the latest magazines, and you've seen him and his antics all over the internet. You can't help but feel nervous at the prospect of meeting someone so handsome. Not to mention someone who has inspired so many dang memes. As you reach your school, you see him getting off his badass motorcycle. Oh, hey, I'm weird. Could you help me find my way around? Of course, my name is a really cool name. My name is Old Superstar Sam. Oh my god. I, oh shoot, that's loud in my ear. But, um, yeah, but what's funny is, um, there's this song for Shia LaBeouf, and it has Hollywood Superstar Shia LaBeouf in the lyrics. You can just call me Shia for short. Everybody else does. Haha. <laughs> What's wrong? I'm sorry, is it the helmet? I know it can be intimidating. Here, let me take it off. <laughs> you can see the little rat tail. You wouldn't believe how great the gas mileage is on this bike. It's like up to here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, so what are you into? What do you dream about? Me, I don't know. Really that's excellent. I'm glad that yesterday you didn't think of your dreams and say tomorrow. Oh my god, that- oh my god, I love this one. A lot of people do that for some reason. Quick save. So you're pretty cute, dream follower. Oh my god, hold on a second. Okay, probably you'll hear me better, but uh... So you're pretty cute, dream follower. Do you want to run away together and live a full uh, life of big things? Uh, of course. Good ending. I mean, two out of ten. God. I didn't know that was gonna happen. That's so quick. Here. Nah, okay. I'll crush you like I crush every pessimist I meet. Game over. Sorry, has crushed your energies. Ending one of ten. So let me just. And now it's neat, but we should be getting to class. Oh, wow, it actually brought me to class. Seems as though the professor has, hasn't gotten here yet. Yeah, we're early. Cool, dude. Dude, we're early. Who's so excited to be in class early? I mean, really. Okay, sorry if my mic quality is changing. I keep changing it. You open your bag and get your homework so that you can turn it in when the professor arrives. Wait, was that homework? I completely forgot. I'm so screwed. You know what, Shia? Too bad you didn't do your homework, bitch. Can I copy your work just for today? I uh, saw you just started today. You don't need to have your work done. Oh. Oh, I see how it is. You want me to fail? Is that it? People are always so concerned with copyrights or who owns what, but they don't get it at. Get. Oh my god. The monster who sends in the way of art. Yours, you're in destroy. You are a gym destroyer. Okay, back, 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 back. Well, I guess so. Your true friend and a dang green master. The class goes by friend. The teacher praises Shia for his preparedness and shames you for copying his work. You don't argue because you don't wish to upset Shia. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. He's the new kid. What are you supposed Why are you blaming me? I got. I. Oh, never mind. Oh, my tongue hurts. It's lunchtime now. The classroom has cleared out. Everyone was eager to get some food in their bellies. You can see that Shia is waiting for you in the walkway. Don't let your dreams just be dreams, please. Hey, sorry if it's weird that I waited for you. I'm just starving and I don't like to eat alone. Here we go. Please leave me alone. You're the worst best friend I've ever had. You're also the only best friend I've ever had. I must go on the journey to find other friends. You never saw the Hollywood superstar Shia LaBeouf again. You can't help but wonder what happened to that glorious mean master. One thing's for sure, though. Shia changed your life for the better. That was a summer you'll never forget, and you'll never again let your dreams be dreams. And then 6 out of 10. That's fine. Okay, cool. But I don't want to eat in the cafeteria. I have to eat in the woods, though. 
Is this supposed to be like the thing where he chases you through the woods and tries to kill you or whatever, just like the song? Before you can object, you find yourself in the forest with Shia. As you look around, you trick yourself in considering taking a picture of the scenery. You notice that you have no cell service. Thanks for coming on this road just to eat your lunch with me. I'm sorry that I didn't have an extra helmet. Your hair is a little messy now. But it looks kinda cute that way. You do your best not to blush, but you're not entirely sure until you succeed. Shia doesn't seem to notice. So did you bring a lunch? In a manner of speaking. Told you! Told you it's just like the song, guys! Exactly like the song! I I wouldn't have found in the description. Shia is brandishing a knife. I'm sorry I mean master, but you're my lunch. You stutter confused and Shia does that sees that you desire an explanation. I'm an actual cannibal. I'm sorry that you had to find out this way. It suddenly makes sense to you. Of course Shia is a cannibal. He must be living in the woods killing people and eating all their bodies. Uh try to fight with Shia. Your attempts are completely in vain. There's no fighting back, there's no talking out of it. Shia is one of the best sort men in all the land, even if he's only wielding a knife. He eats you for lunch and returns to school without you. Okay, I resume. Auto. Attempt to run. You sprint down a nearby pathway just with the escape Shia and he's saying yes. Actually, you know what? Try to reason with Shia. The attempts are completely in vain, there's no fighting back. Uh, okay. He eats you for lunch and returns to school without you. Okay, attempt to run. And uh, you know that one. Uh, after running for a while, you're pretty sure you've escaped, and this music is kind of creepy. You come to a bridge. You cross it and find a huge cabin. Oh my god, it's just like the song! There's a spark of hope in your heart. You might have lucked out in time and help. Uh, stay outside. You have to get on the left side of the cabin for a few minutes. After a while, you hear footsteps behind you. You turn around and see Shia behind you. One slightly you are dead, so I make short work of you. I just took off my earbud, by the way, that I had on. No hesitation, you spin up the stairs and into the vanguardly unlocked cabin door. You realize with your own heart that you're in Shia's cabin. There's a computer in front of you. You feel compelled to use it. You click on the Shia's to-do list. Kill me, master. Eat me, master. Follow my dreams and make things me. Well, at least he's organized. Ah, uh, thank memes. I'm trying to access the meme folder, but Shia has it encrypted. This guy takes his memes seriously. Boy project. For reasons unknown, Shia has an instant HD wipe, hard drive wipe, option on his desktop. You click it effectively ruining his computer. Oh my god, he totally wants to kill me now. You hear the door opening and you hide behind the new budget. What's this? Has someone been using my computer? My hard drive has been wiped! My my name for it. It's gone. Try beginning to sob. You know this might be your only chance. Uh, attack Shia. You jump on Shia while his back is turned, wrestling the knife from the sand and plugging it into his head. You're slaying Hollywood superstar Shia LaBeouf. He whispers his last words. Do you feel good about yourself? He wants to know you're doomed to my fate. You must rebuild the names. You must be their guardian. You catch your reflection and see from the face you have become a Hollywood superstar Shia LaBeouf. You wonder how many shies there were before you took up the mantle. Ultimately, it doesn't matter. You have moon guardian now. For better or for worse. True ending. I found the true ending. But that's not the one that I want to do. I want to do the ninth ending. You attempt to flee, but shy sees you moving. You become as full of rage about its fallen memes. Oh my memes! How could you have done this to my memes? You could feel cold still slam into your back as he takes his revenge. Game over, Shia has slain you with some new rage. Well, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below, or email me what I should do next. Subscribe if you're new, and maybe I'll be on your favorite.